to 12 years of one of the deadliest terrorist attacks India has ever witnessed, Pakistan has come out to accept the presence of Lashkar-e-Taiba terrorists who facilitated the deadly 26-11 terror attack in Mumbai. Pakistan's top investigative authority, that is a federal investigation agency, has released a list of 11 terrorists who brought the Al-Fuz boat and used the boat to launch attacks and unleash the same on India's financial hub, that is Mumbai. The 880-page long list includes names such as Muhammad Amjad Khan of Multan, who purchased the boat, Shahid Gafoor from Bahawalpur, who was the captain of the boat, and nine other crew members. The list also mentions high-profile and most wanted terrorists in the country. However, it makes no mention of Hafiz Saeed, Masood Azhar, or Dawood Ibrahim. The UN-listed international terrorist Hafiz Saeed was the mastermind of the 26-11 attacks. The chief of jaish e mohammed Masood Azhar, was listened as an international was listed as an international terrorist last year. This after the Pulwama terror attacks last year in February, which killed more than 40 paramilitary forces. Earlier this year, a Pakistan court had convicted Saeed for five years for financing terror. Now, when it comes to Dawood Ibrahim, Pakistan has never accepted that he is in the country, but it is well known that Ibrahim stays in Karachi. In fact, Dawood Ibrahim, who is a UN-listed terrorist as well, has his address mentioned in Karachi, the provincial capital of southern Sindh province. The terror attacks, which began on November 26th in 2008, lasted for four days. Ten LET terrorists came to Mumbai through the sea route from Pakistan and carried out a series of coordinated shooting attacks and bombing attacks across the city of Mumbai. After sailing to the city under the cover of darkness, the terrorists targeted major landmarks of Mumbai, with the first attack taking place at the crowded Chhatrapati Shivaji Terminus railway station. 166 lives were lost and more than 300 people were injured.